good morning guys welcome back to life with liz if you haven't already make sure to subscribe to my channel turn on your post notifications that way you'll be notified every time your girl posts a new video good morning, good morning guys good morning. we are up early uh just waiting on my mom to get here so that we can take off the girls are ready mm -hmm. oh sorry i'm blinding you with the light adrian's over there putting on her earrings uh. <laughs> So <clears throat> we're just waiting on my parents to get here uh, and we're gonna take off. I am I do have to go take the girls to Caitlin's house. I'm gonna go drop them off at Caitlin's house and then I'm gonna take my aunt to her appointment. Uh, Caitlin's your best friend? <laughs> Alright guys, so just waiting on them. Uh we'll see you at probably Caitlin's will be the first stop, so we'll see you there. Hey guys, so we just made it to her appointment. We um, we dropped off the girls and with Caitlin, and so now we're gonna go see. We're gonna go find the building because I think it's towards the back. Because there's one that's called a laser center. There's one that's called a laser center, and then there's one that's the actual surgery center and I think that one's towards the back so let me find it <laughs> hey guys so we took my aunt to her appointment and there was no appointment we get there we went to two different places one was a surgery center the other one was a laser center um, then I called back to the original doctor and her appointment was with the original doctor yet they called us and told us it was at the surgery center so that was frustrating it was way across town went back to get her to her appointment and it was just an evaluation for the surgery which again was really disappointing or frustrating because she had the I had called to get the results of an MRI that she had had that they had sent her to to get um, to see what was going on with her eyes so uh, I had called back to get the results of that MRI and that's when they told me oh she needs cataract surgery should we go ahead and schedule let me call her back let me ask her if she wants to do the cataract surgery so she said yes call them back she's like okay let me go ahead and get a schedule for you they, they scheduled me for the fifth which is today and there was no surgery it's it was just like a, an evaluation first prior to surgery the appointment took forever it is we were in there for a good two hours two and a half hours for that appointment so and then for them to tell her there's no guarantee with the cataract surgery if her vision is going to improve or not so i don't think that she's going to get it she's thinking she said that she would think about it and so i don't think she's going to get it so um her son has been asking her to go he lives in texas so i think she, that that pushed her even more to like me i'm not gonna i'm not gonna do the surgery i'm gonna go see my son first so. but we got we're over the appointment now because she didn't eat no, i don't think any of us uh any of us ate so we came to get some breakfast and once they bring us our breakfast i'll show you guys what we're getting but what an event for morning any breakfast uh, i did check on the girls Caden uh Kaden already fed them um they're watching a movie already and having popcorn so yeah this early but they're already eating popcorn <laughs> but they've already eaten so we're gonna get something to eat and then head over to pick up the girls stay tuned <laughs> All right, guys. We just—they just bought us our food. I got some hash browns, bacon, eggs, and a biscuit and gravy. And the ladies both got wheat toast and eggs, bacon, and uh, hash browns. They both got the same thing. So, about to try this out. The biscuit and gravy looks delicious. I'm trying to set it up so you guys can see me. Let me try this. It's going to rain. I'll tell you what. 
I've never been here, but I've heard a lot of good things about it. It's the Naughty Pine. I've never been here. It's my first time here. This kind of really are delicious. Gosh, are really good. Definitely delicious. So I'm gonna finish eating and we'll be back. All right, guys. We just finished eating, and we are on our way to go pick up the girls. I. Hey guys, so we did come home, but um, I got got my stuff to make some dinner, and unfortunately, my Ari is acting up like really bad. I haven't given myself a shot, um, you know, because I had been sick. But oh, my hands, my hands are killing me. My hands and my knee, and it's all this rain and humidity. So uh, I'm gonna bite the bullet. I'm gonna give myself a, an injection right now. Because I can't take it. I'm going to do that and probably take some ibuprofen. Uh, my hand is pretty swollen. It's My pinky is horrid. And my index finger. Uh, they're hurting me so bad right now. So I'm going to give myself a shot. An injection. And then I'll see what happens. There's no way that I'll be able to make dinner. So I'll probably end up having to buy something. Um, I can't cut anything. My The pinky on both of my hands... Um, they're just, they're gone. They're done. So I'm in a lot of pain. I'm going to, I'm going to go ahead and take this injection and an ibuprofen and hopefully I will start to feel better soon, fast. All right. So I did just give myself a shot and I know that I'm in pain when I do the shot and I did it super fast and it didn't hurt because the pain in my leg is worse than the actual shot. So so I know I had mentioned rain earlier. So we, um, here in California, we are having extreme, extreme rain. Um, it's been nonstop raining since yesterday. Uh, it'll, I shouldn't say nonstop because it'll stop for just a little bit, but it'll pick right back up. Um, today going to Bakersfield was a bit scary for me because I hate, I hate driving in bad weather, but I gotta do it again tomorrow. I gotta go take uh, my mom to her physical therapy. So um, we'll see how that goes. But hopefully the rain will subside a little bit and it won't be as ugly tomorrow morning. Because tomorrow I will be taking the girls with me. Um, Caitlin has. Uh, so for those that don't know, Caitlin did get uh, did she did get the job. Um, I know that they had said they were going to check her references, but I don't know if I ever told you guys that they did um, offer her. They sent her a letter of employment and she had to respond by a certain time. So she responded. So tomorrow she's going to get um, fingerprinted, uh, drug tested, all of that stuff for the job. And so, uh, of course, that's way more important than anything else. So uh, I will have the girls with me tomorrow to take to my mom's appointment. So um, we'll take them with us and they can sit in the little lobby area with my dad while my mom does her physical therapy and I'll just, I'll just be back and forth with them. So I gotta, um, gotta make sure to take them, uh, a tablet, a coloring book, something like that so that they can have to entertain themselves, uh, while, while my mom does her physical therapy. But, um, it's usually not that long, so it shouldn't be too bad. And um, and then Caitlin today said, you know, I'm gonna go by tomorrow in the in the afternoon, and I'm gonna go pick up both girls. I want them to come spend the night with me. I'm like, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> so it'll be fun. Gabby was so excited. They didn't want to leave today. Gabby was so excited to be with her sister today. I get there, and that girl was all comfortable with. <coughs> excuse me. No shoes, 
she was just like up on the couch like she like if that was her house that girl got comfy real quick but both girls had a good time but they um because i did get them up early um on the way home they were kind of tired so i was time to take a nap but i think they kind of napped a little bit in the car and then once we got home that was that was it they're not napping anymore so we'll see how it goes tomorrow because they'll have to get up early again tomorrow so we'll see we'll see how that goes but uh, I did give myself my injection. I'm about to get some ibuprofen. I'm going to do the 800 milligrams. I know I've told you guys before, I'm very sensitive when it comes to medication. So I'm sure that that 800 milligram ibuprofen is going to knock me out. I hope not. Um, well, we'll see, but, uh, then I have to figure out what we're going to do for dinner. Um, I don't know what we have here and obviously I can't cut anything up right now art's still at work so I can't um, I can't wait till he gets off so I mean I can it, just not to make anything so we'll figure something out and whatever it is that we do um, we'll be back and I'll show you what what we're gonna what, what we decide to eat because I have no idea right now so I will be back the next day good morning guys uh, so last night I was my flare-up got pretty bad I ended up taking uh, the 800 milligram ibuprofen twice and oh my stomach is burning watch out move it move it these dogs and make sure they don't jump on me uh, so anyway I got bad um, I ended up taking ibuprofen and my stomach this morning is burning I need to go get some um, antacids I, I knew it was gonna happen because I took I took a lot of ibuprofen so but I do feel better this morning I did take my shot my injection and I do feel better this morning didn't even check the mail yesterday but my mom and dad are here we are gonna head out to her appointment so I will see you guys there hey guys so we are here at my mom's therapy I think we're a little bit early but um, yeah we are early we they showed up to pick me up but uh, my sister went and picked up my dad because my dad had an appointment tomorrow this morning I didn't know about it and I think my parents forgot about it so I do have to go when when we're done I'm gonna go pick up the girls art stayed with the girls so I didn't have to bring them out um, but I do have to go pick up the girls and then um, go to my mom and dad's to get uh, to fix my dad's medication I gotta fill his pill box and then he needs to stop taking a certain medication because of the surgery so I'm gonna go ahead and get all of that taken care of so just gonna wait for them to call my mom and she can start her therapy Hey guys, so we got out of my mom's appointment, but my gosh, my stomach was burning so bad. Good thing that right across the way here, there was a Rite Aid. I was gonna vlog while I was in there, but they had music going, so I didn't wanna get copyrighted. So, um, but I stopped and got me some, some Tums. I'm about to tear these little bad boys up right now. Oh, my stomach is burning. And it's horrible. I need to, make sure and i completely ran out and usually i have some at home but i completely ran out and i didn't take any last night when i took my um ibuprofen so i'm about to take them right now so i will be back hey guys we did come to eat i'm trying to hurry up because i don't want to get copyrighted but i'll show you guys the food there'll be no sound i started eating without uh vlogging uh but here we go
Hey guys, so we did come to get some dinner. Uh, I didn't vlog before we went in, so uh, <laughs> there's no audio, but we came to Buffalo Wild Wings and it was delicious. <laughs> A little too good, I am stuffed. Kaylin took the girls to her house uh, to spend the night at her house. They were super, Gabby was so, so excited. She's She was super happy to go, so uh, that made me happy. But we just got out, it's late. We were there for a long time. I didn't realize how late it was. We were there for a long time, but it was delicious. It was so good. Uh, Buffalo Wild Wings is always good. We got the um, lemon pepper and mango habanero uh, wings, delicious. We had that and then I had uh, two of the, what were they called, the margaritas? The Paloma mar perfect margarita, some I don't know, some kind of margarita, but it was good. They were good. Get you fucked up margaritas? No, they weren't like that. Like I'm still good, but uh, they were just delicious. And now I'm cold and I am ready to go home. So we're on our way home. So I'll see you guys there. Hey guys, so we are back home. We did make it home. It's late. I'm tired. I'm cold. So. I'm going to be going to bed, but that concludes today's video. Make sure to comment, like, share, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thanks for watching, guys. Till next time.